but yeah of course sometimes it's nice to <clears throat> you know be at home and just you know have your complete organized setup housed there at your at your service you know and not just have to think okay everything i need for the next two or three weeks have to be in the suitcase i cannot forget anything there's a little bit of stress sometimes but yeah after this all these years now you have a sort of like a routine what needs to be in the suitcase so um no it doesn't wear off so much you know and it's you know i'm doing it for so many years now i am um, still enjoy it obviously my wife would like me to be home more often so i could like help out a little bit with the kids um the boys, the, the two older ones, the boys, they, they're okay with it because, you know, they are 14 and 10, so they understand it and they sort of like have their own friends already and they have things to do. The girls, they, yeah, they miss me a lot because they, they're smaller, they're six, four and two years old. So they sometimes, yeah, miss me and they also not really um, understand how time is working. So if you say, yeah, daddy is home soon, he said, so yeah, how many more times do I have to sleep before you're home? That's what you understand. They don't understand months or weeks or days. They just go sleep. So how many more sleeps? And then I say, yeah, maybe as much thing as if you have on one hand, so many sleeps. So that's sort of like, that's what they understand. So um, yeah, for them it's a little harder. And for me it's hard to go away, you know. Then um, when you go out of the door, they all come running. I said, oh, daddy, give me one more kiss, one more kiss. And you're about to just drop your suitcase and call the team and say, oh, I'm sick, I can't come, I have to stay at home, you know, because you just want to be with the kids. Um, so that's that's a hard part of the job. Yes, it is. Yeah, last break. Yep. I have been here several times. Um, it's always nice. But I suppose Adelaide is like most of Australia. It's People are more laid back, more relaxed and um, not so stressed about their, I don't know, careers and, you know. So it's a nice... Um, way they, they approach life down here, you know, and I really uh, appreciate or really enjoy that. And um, without being arrogant or like blowing my own trumpet, but I think I have a few fans here. So that also helps you to feel welcome, you know, that the fans like shout your name and, and they go, yeah, Jens, yeah, good ride and give it a go today. He's a consummate professional. He, and a he, real hard worker. I mean, I think he's a bit of a team man. So he, you know, he works for himself and his team. Go Jens! <laughs> So it also makes you more more welcome, you know, and um, Adelaide is a great city. It's big, but not crazy big, you know, and you don't have any crazy stupid traffic jams here. Um, it's just a nice, nice mix, you know, what I'm, you know what I mean? And on top of that, my friend O'Grady lives here, so, you know, it's good to be here. <laughs>